Christina here with a plan with me. This is for July 4th through the 10th, and I know this is getting uploaded, you know, kind of late. I, I know I said I want to do these on Sundays, but Sunday and Monday was extremely busy with the holidays and everything. Um, I did have this done on Sunday, but I was not able to record it. And then, again, like I said, yesterday was, you know, the 4th of July, so, yeah. Um, but I didn't do one last week because... For one, it was just taking entirely too long, and I, this was the spread that I did last week, and that's just, that's just too much for me. <laughs> All honesty, it's pretty papers and pretty stickers and stuff, but, and it was very time consuming. I had to cut each, each individual one out, and, because I don't have a scan and cut, I have a Cricut Expression 2, but I don't have a scan and cut, I still got to plan my, do my month, <laughs> but, um, <clears throat> So I was like, I need, you know, I want to do this a different way. I was not happy with it. Um, like I said, they were pretty, you know, stickers and stuff, but just, it wasn't my style. I just, all that was just, it, it was driving me nuts. It was too much clutter, and I just, I was like, no, okay, I got to do something different. So, I pulled out my Stampin' Up! products. <laughs> These are the new, um, in one of the new in color collections from Stampin' Up! It is, um... The 2016-2017, I do believe. <laughs> I always, I don't know, I always do that wrong. But um, it's the Dapper Denim color, and this is the Whisper White cardstock, and I inked all the edges up with the um, Dapper Denim ink, and I love this ink. It is so, this works perfect for this week's layout, and um, it'll also work good in like a little nautical theme. Yes, it would be gorgeous. Um, and then I just used, everybody has those little bullets and stuff. I just used, you know, some sticko stickers, the red, white, and blue ones. And I used those for my bullets. Um, and then I just had some stickers in my session white that I got, like, from Hobby Lobby or whatever. And that's what I used to decorate it all up with. My note section, I covered in some more designer series paper and um, Whisper White cardstock. I did some more of the little stars, and see these are all, oh, just look how good these turned out, um, <coughs> I am though going to go on Etsy, and oh, and I hope I did not have the mic covered, but I am going to go on to Etsy, and I'm going to find me some weekend banners, or maybe see if I can create my own banners, and stamp them out, because I love stamping, like, I changed my numbers, because if you remember my other video, I had the stickers that come with it, and I just didn't like that, um, I want to... I'm going to stamp and ignore my boo-boo. Yeah, let the clear block touch. But, um, I like how this is stamped out. The numbers can coordinate with the collection that I'm using. Um, if you want process videos on how I did this, just let me know. If not, then I'm just going to keep doing it like this and telling you how I did it. And all I did was just cut, you know, measured out my squares with my ruler and just cut them down to size. And that's basically it. I do need to figure out what I want to do with headers and how I want to do, you know, different headers. That is one thing that I do have to figure out. Um, so, like, I'm still new to this, and I think this is good for this week's layout. So, if you have any questions or comments, just leave them down below. I just wanted to show you how you can, um, you don't have to buy all those fancy dancy stickers or whatever. You can buy you some stamps some ink and some paper and you can create your own little layout like this and you know use some stickers from your stash or you can stamp it up <laughs> but um yeah if you have any questions or comments just leave them down below all the products in here can be purchased um through my website which is i'll put the link down below in the description box as long as all my social media links where you can find me and yeah if, again if you have any questions or comments leave them down below i'll ask, answer them as soon as i can and yeah, I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Bye!